Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Tis I, the one and only Archer with Archer Astrology. And guys, it is the it is it we're in full moon. It is literally going on right now. So full moon, super moon in Capricorn, Cancer's opposing sign during Cancer season. Well, we've got Venus heading into Cancer, Mercury and the Sun getting ready to go to Leo, and Jupiter hanging out in Aries. So we got we got some wild stuff going on. So after this full moon, I wanted to check in because I know how I know how my people are. My collective, this is Archer's family. We we do what we got to do. We get the job done here at Archer. So I know you guys were manifesting your butts off. The moon is probably extremely tired this morning and, and doesn't even want to deal with it right now. It's like, oh my God, I sat in retrograde. Somebody help me out here. I got too much going on. So we got to do an outlook. We got to take a look and see what what happened? That's exactly what I want to know right now. Where it's 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 uh, July thirteenth, and we got that full moon that came through. What's the outlook? What's the energy coming on? We're and we're gonna do it just like we always do for an outlook. Gonna grab the top deck. Gonna grab all reliable for some clarifiers, and we're gonna see what happened. I want to see what is gonna come in. What's going on today? What is the result of all this manifesting and intentions that archers people have set? Here we go. All right, archers, let's do it to it. I'll call you guys archers. I don't care. I'm archer. I, we, do, we do what we want. It's archer astrology. So let's go. Archer's outlook for July 13th. We're just going to call it the super moon outlook, the cappy moon outlook. What's happening? What's going on here? 5D energy forecast. Bottom of the deck, the four of pentacles shows up. Ooh, the four of pentacles. The moon is the fortress in which you are sitting there grabbing your intentions just like that woman grabs the purse in the Lightseer's deck. Very strong and abundant. Very hanging on to everything. Your intentions have been locked down and locked in place. Ooh, strength, adjustment. And the moon is finding balance and adjustment and getting taking in all the information and getting ready to dish it out. It's going to happen. That's strength. That's, that's, I mean, that's like basically the sun at that point. It's coming forth and getting everything you want. Nine of Pentacles is the next one out. Oh, this is a great abundancy that's happened. The moon was paying attention this time. The Capricorn energy, it's a very strong, grounded, earthy moon. It, it's plugged in, it's hooked up, and it's listening, and it's picking up everything, and you're getting it. Strength with Nine of Pentacles. It's, it's, it's the moon saying, yep. <laughs> it's the moon saying, yep. You're getting everything. It's going to happen. Guys, whatever we manifested this time around, it's happening. And I'm pretty sure that if you had simply wrote down the sun or put a big smiley face in your notebook, that's basically what's going to happen. Holy crap. I'm, oh, I feel warm. I feel like I got chills all over. And, and, and you're staying firm in your energy, four of pentacles. Oh, my goodness. Whatever you said, did, wrote down, and manifested is going to happen. You've got double sun happening right here. Double Leo energy happening right here. That's nothing but strength. A what scares a lion? Maybe a crab claw pinching their leg. I don't know. But nothing scares a lion. You, you try to touch a cub lion once and see what mama lion does? Don't don't even try it. You're going to pull back less than a nub. You ain't going to come back with an arm at all. You know what I mean? So this is the... My goodness. Stop. Stop. <laughs> and with a, with a queen of pentacles next to it. This is the moon and Saturn retrograde and all that fun stuff that we all like to talk about here on YouTube. Dishing it out. And, and dude, obviously when we've got Leo just up the wazoo right now, this is saying that going into Leo season, all of a sudden the fruits of your labor are going to happen. It's only a week or two away, guys. This is an insanely good reading. Leo season is going to rock for my collective. That's all I got to say. We are going to have it really good. If all you said during the full moon last night was, I just want a strawberry milkshake, watch out because your truck, <laughs> watch out because your truck bed's going to get filled with strawberry milkshake. You just wanted a small, the small truck bed full, maybe. Oh my goodness. Uh, it, it's happiness. It's smiling. It's it, Leo's have that, that smile, that, that, that big freaky creeper smile that just is like, I got you or it's, or it's the, I'm going to get you, but either way it's going to happen. All right. Seven of swords. We got to cut this thing up. Let's see where we're going. Pre-cut post-cut. Oh, queen of swords. Talk about leveling up going from a, oh man, I don't know what to do. Seven of swords into a queen of swords. Looking, dude, I did the Queen's jeans. Those are cool. Jeans and a leather jacket. Can't, you can't go wrong. So, we, do we need any more clarifiers? Page of Wands. 
it going, this is like all fire. No wonder I'm burning up, you know, frick. Aries can drive a flaming chariot if they want. Leo is a flaming chariot. They're the sun. And Sagittarius, they'll just burn your house down. It's fine. That's, it's a, this is page of wands. It's communication. You're going to get to the point with so much coming at you that you're not going to know what to do with it. You're going to be like, oh my God, when did I become so famous and become a star? This is insanity. Holy crap. You're living in your energy. This full man. This full moon did its job, man. It's it's got it all going on. This is this is the whole shebang. Choices made, decisions made, the lovers, all the usual stuff coming out. With the manifestations that you have set this time around have paid off and are gonna work out. You are a freaking queen of swords. You are owning this energy, and that's literally what we're talking about here, guys. So today's outlook is nothing but goodness. Just freaking enjoy it and stay strong and confident, knowing. You're the freaking emperor. You're Burger King, man. You get it your way. That's how you do it. And what you did last night, as we go into Leo season coming up here, it's going to happen. When all we've got basically is surrounded by sun, fire, happy energy, it's going to be awesome, guys. This is too cool. Oh, there we go. That was fun, wasn't it? Told you. Earth is moving. That's what happens. This is awesome, guys. You did great this time around. Good stuff is coming in. Start looking for it because you're going to start with those little page of wand signs where somebody's going to be like, looking good. You're going to be like, nobody ever says that to me. And then it's going to keep progressing from that to like, um, I, I got extra food today. You want to come? You want to eat something? You want to share? And it's just going to keep going. And by Leo season, it's just going to be like, oh, collective, I love you. Dude, this is good stuff. Embrace it and enjoy it. Make it a good day. For Archer, we'll be back with another one later. Peace and love and all the goodness that's coming. See you guys later. Like, share, comment, subscribe, etc. so on and so forth. And I love you guys. Bye.